Hey guys, it's the Friction here, or Tiger Tank 1 2, however you want to call me, I don't really care. And today we're actually <laughs> playing World of Warships. Now, we're running our South Carolina, and I have no idea how to play this game correctly. And I feel like the noob that I was years ago in the of Tanks. Oh, 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 iceberg, iceberg, that's how the Titanic sank. Now, you can see that we're playing uh, obviously low tier since I have not played a lot of games in World of Warships, but I have like 14 games, and in these 14 games, I won every single one of them. I have like 100% win rate right now in World of Warships, while I have no idea what I'm doing, and that is <laughs> quite impressive. So we're driving, or pretty much we're setting sails, unfortunately we do not have any sails, we're setting sails with the South Carolina Tier 3 US um, battleship actually. And unfortunately I'm not like Jingles, I do not know all the stories about all the def different battleships. Um, and uh, I cannot recount to you the story of the South Carolina unfortunately, I do not know anything about this particular battleship. Just that it um, does have uh, four towers with, I have no idea what kind of caliber guns they are, but they pack a punch at least at tier 3. And um, I think that's all what matters in World of Warships right now. Now, um, yeah, speaking of, of Jingles, uh, he's right now at uh, Gamescom, I think, Cologne. And uh, speaking of Gamescom Cologne, uh, a new tank has been released for World of Tanks, a new um, premium tier 8 vehicle. The tank destroyer um, Scorpion, um, Rheinmetall Scorpion G. Uh, amazing new premium tank if you guys are interested you should probably check out my video on it uh, a little bit of uh, <laughs> a little bit of advertisement on my own channel in another video while i'm playing world of warships now i'm, I'm sorry if i'm not taking this game too seriously uh, i'm just not very good at battleships I'm, I'm a little bit slow but i have to be honest the game does look a lot nicer than it did look um like five or six months ago and they have added a new uh german uh battleship line actually and they have uh gotten my interest yeah mostly through jingles since i watched his video um on certain battleships um and it looked really like a lot of fun i actually Actually, the game is a lot of fun, I gotta be honest. I'm having a blast playing this battleship most of the time. Unfortunately, right now, I do not have anything to shoot at. But um, that will probably change any second. Now, since we're a battleship, it takes us a little longer to get to the battlefield. Um, <laughs> or to get anywhere. Uh, as you can see right now, we are going at maximum, I think, 18 knots. That is not very fast. And unfortunately, there are a lot of icebergs and little islands that are blocking our view. And you can see there's even a little village right there. there. That is a nice amount of detail. And yeah, so I'm gonna just put it down a little bit. I'm rambling on, talking a little bit much. Let's get some targets. So yeah, um, I've been planning to start a new World of Warships series since um, I did say I would be playing this game back in the days when I when the beta was released. Um, oh, no, 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 we're not. No, no, no. He drove right into me. Or I just drove right into him. I do not know. I think he was faster, that's why. Oh, now we have a South Carolina we can shoot at. Our guns are not turning fast enough. Come on, guys, crank it up a little bit. I want to get some good shots off the... Give it some lead. There we go. The first volley was not very accurate, but the second should hit. Yeah, well, both of them hit. Three shots hit from four. 
that is a pretty good statistic in my opinion. But that South Carolina is going to be gone very soon. And actually my entire flotilla has taken care of the rest. So yeah, I was not needed in this encounter at all. So yeah, this is how all my 15 games have been going. I've won every single one while doing absolutely nothing. Um, I don't want to complain, I mean, <laughs> free wins, but uh, I have been kind of neglected a lot of times. Maybe it's just because I'm a new player and nobody really wants to shoot me because they're afraid of my uh, beautiful South Carolina. And back there, that is also South Carolina. Three, one degree, and we're gonna get a nice shot off. Hopefully it's gonna hit right in the citadel. Ah, I think he's turning in. And we just lost sight of him. Uh, both of our shots kind of went to the wrong direction. Oh, he's turning in. He's turning again. Oh, I think this Holberg is gonna take some hits. Uh, careful, careful not to drive into the island. Unfortunately, our guns in the back will not be able to fire since we just do not have the angle to turn them around. And we cannot shoot out through our own battleship. Unfortunately, I I have pitched that idea to uh, <laughs> different captains. So that's definitely gonna hit. That's gonna do some damage. Citadel hit. Oh god, that was so close. How about that one? At least one of them went right. Oh god, incoming fire. That looked pretty awesome. Unfortunately, right now we only have two turrets aimed at the South Carolina, since our other two turrets are currently uh, turning. I duked both of them shots. Terrible accuracy. Hopefully, there's a there's a better spread right there. A hit, but no pen, no citadel hit. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, now this is definitely gonna hurt him. Come on, Citadel hit. No Citadel hit, unfortunately for us. But, um... A very nice... Volley there. Nonetheless. I looked like a Citadel hit right there. That South Carolina is not doing too good. Being all by himself, getting fired at from every direction. That, it's gotta suck, but he's going down fighting at least, guns blazing. Uh, two hits. Next hit is gonna finish him, yep, definitely. There we go. In the end, we still did some damage. And we were fined 10 credits and um, 1 XP for uh, team damage there. Terrible, terrible. And you can see we've played, wait, let's go to the summary right here. We've played 14 games, 100% victories. <laughs> this is, this is a freaking joke. I'm so bad at this game. How do I have 14 victories in a row? So, okay. My plan, at least for uh, this kind of uh, theory, series, is to reach at least the Colorado. I want to get the Colorado and I'm going to be playing the battleship line since I'm too stupid for the destroyer line and I just do not want to play the cruisers who are faster than battleships but do not have the same armament as battleships. So I just want to play the uh, big guns out there, right? And I do not want to play the freaking aircraft carriers since they look boring as hell so i'd say for the first episode we're gonna play one more game in our um, south carolina and we're gonna hope to find some 
Germans. Maybe we can shoot some Fritz. Yeah. So I'm really uh, just close the game. Unfortunately, minimized it. I'm really the uh, sea bells in War Thunder. Since they just uh, a few days ago, I think, um, uploaded that trailer of the uh, Sea Bells, the little preview, it looked pretty awesome. I mean, it was all in game graphics. But I'm not sure. They, they're trying to go a different route. They do not want to add big battleships. Well, they're, they're not sure yet if they're going to add battleships. Since um, the the only ships that we have seen were like little patrol boats or little, um, very little cruisers. I'm not even sure if it was a cruiser. I think one of them was a torpedo boat and the other one was um, this Russian, I don't know, what, what was it called? I think it was a patrol boat with the T-34 turret on top of it and um, Katyusha rocket launchers, which is pretty damn awesome. But uh, in my category, not really fits does not really fit to the um, to the battleship scene. At least I think a lot of people expected much more. Uh, if you talk to them about um, sea combat or naval naval warfare, naval combat, I think that's why a lot of people are kind of disappointed. But still, a lot of people, including me, are very excited for the. Uh, addition of those patrol boats uh, and um, who knows I think they're gonna add some more stuff eventually they're probably gonna be um, bigger ships but they'll just need some time I mean um, Gaijin is a big developer but still they're adding a new complete new segment to War Thunder which is quite amazing they're still not finished yet with the um, with the tanks on War Thunder unfortunately I'm not really that hooked on the tanks on War Thunder um, I think the, the one reason, or the one thing I have to blame is obviously World of Tanks. Uh, too much fun with that game. And uh, it just consumes so much of my time for me to be able to um, play the War Thunder Ground Forces stuff. Yeah, but uh, I gotta be honest, the uh, planes or the aerial combat in War Thunder is 10 times better than on um, World of Airplanes. And uh, I think even war wargaming knows that because they're they are very different, and War Thunder is just a lot more fun. But people, just like in World of Tanks, War Thunder has been losing um, its player base um, quite rapidly in the last two years. I think a lot of people are frustrated, have moved on, or just uh, have played every single battle thirty times uh, enough than uh, they yeah they did before so yeah i mean who knows uh i, <laughs> I mean everybody complains uh there are a lot of my friends who complain about my videos that they're too long they always laugh when i upload one of the videos they they, they ask me how i can do this how can i upload something that is 40 minutes long and expect to have some certain views and the best part is that I just do it. I, I don't really care. I just upload because it's fun. And uh, gives me something else to do than just sit around all day, play video games, or, you know, meet people. Which is fine as well, but, uh, you know, uploading stuff on YouTube is quite fun as well. <laughs> so, uh, you can see that one of our ships, uh, the destroyer right there, the Wicked was just knocked out. And uh, I think we're going into the Dragon's Nest if we're gonna go in there, but uh, somebody has to contest the B flag or the B uh, area. Since we only have one destroyer right there, the Samson was getting knocked out. So we're gonna try to secure the kill. I'm not sure if we were able to do that. Ah, terrible hit. We're gonna turn in. 
since this is not a battle that we want to be facing. This is not. Oh, there we go. No Citadel hit, unfortunately. I think I should take out the uh, destroyer over there. That is definitely one of the priorities. I hope those hit. Oh my god, this is so frustrating. Eesh. Oh my god. The accuracy on this thing is just not... Not what you're expecting of a battleship. They're, they're taking me apart, this Holberg. Which is actually a... Well, it's a tier 3. Hey, 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 hey. I'm running away from, uh, I think, uh, a little cruiser. And I'm a battleship, so I'm gonna be turning around, aiming all my guns at him. And my secondaries are engaging the Coldberg, which is nice, definitely. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Taking a full broadside. And he's gonna. He's gonna take it now. We're gonna fight the fire afterwards, right now. Uh, we're waiting for the second fire. Actually, I'm waiting for the second fire. We want not want to engage in the fire uh, as soon as I don't have the second fire. He's very aggressive. There we go. We knocked him out. That's the beauty of a battleship. Just has so much HP. Let's fight the fire. We still have one more cruiser over there. I hope he has no torpedoes. That would suck. That would suck so much. My other guns in the back are ready to engage him. There we go. Give me a good hit. Yes. There we go. We, uh, I think we destroyed one of his um, turrets, or he just, he destroyed one of ours. I'm not sure right now. Uh, is he ramming me? Is that a serious maneuver? Holy shit! He just he just took so much. Oh my god! I, I think I'm gonna be sinking soon. I have a huge hole in my ship. Yeah, I just died hard. <laughs> Damn it. What a ram. I did not expect that guy to be ramming. Actually, I should have seen it coming. Wow, that was, I think, for him that that was uh, the better deal. Uh, a tier 3 cruiser for a tier 3 battleship. I think that was definitely a, a, a good bargain. Oh, what is this? This is the Kawashi. Wow, this thing has a lot of turrets. This has like... Four turrets on the side and two. One on the front, one in the back. Six turrets. With... Um, two guns per turret. So, pretty much you can aim eight guns at one guy. Wow, that's I should have went the I should have went down the Japanese line. Holy shit, they have a lot of firepower. But it does kind of look like a uh, Oh yeah, the uh, Japanese symbol for the navy, I think. Well, you do have the naval. Oh no, they don't have the naval flag on the ship, unfortunately. So yeah, uh I will not try to bore you guys any longer uh, I had my fun in the South Carolina um, I'll probably report back in the uh, I have no idea what it's called I think I have to check which ship I will unlock next uh, I think it's going to be I'm gonna guess it's the Wyoming no that's the wrong button ah yeah it's the Wyoming tier 4 Wyoming 9,000 experience and 870,000 credits that I'll need. Entered service in um, 1912 into South Carolina. Entered service in... No, 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 I don't want to see that. 
1910, two years prior. Hmm. Weak armament. I think I have 305 millimeter guns. So if we take a look at the Wyoming, I f I'm not sure. They look like the same guns. Okay, I'm gonna go to the tech tree. I'm gonna check the South Carolina, the one. That's the Mark V and Mark VII. Okay, obviously we have better guns. Thank God, I was worried. It's still the same. Um... Wow, this thing has freaking four turrets in the back. So I'll be driving this one backwards. Only two on, in the front, so I'll be driving this one sideways, obviously. Like, eight turrets? <laughs> eight turrets would be great. Only six turrets, unfortunately. Like, just imagine, two more turrets in the front, and you have eight turrets. But you can focus, like, you can aim at one target, six turrets. Twelve guns, that's twelve guns, That that's amazing. Twelve... 100, no, 305 millimeter guns, Mark 7, and you can unleash a full broadside. So yeah, uh, anyway, <laughs> I will report back with this battleship as soon as I'm finished grinding the, this battleship right here. <laughs> so I'll see you guys in the next video.